video of what's going on guys in today's video i'm going to be showing you how we can get the pink struggles in gta 5 online after the patch of 1.66 yeah i'm going to be showing you three different methods on how you can get the pink joggers so that in case one of them doesn't work you guys can just use the other ones to make sure you obtain the pink joggers plus all of the methods are going to be super simple and easy to do as they'll take around three minutes each but quickly before getting to that if you're interested in joining our 11,000 subscriber shotcut giveaway then all you gotta do is drop a like subscribe to the channel and then comment the word giveaway and you'll be entered into that but without wasting any more time let's just get straight into the video all right so for the first method i'm going to show you how you can get the fake pink joggers so obviously the best way to get the pink joggers for the male character is going to be using two consoles and netcut however i'm going to show you a way you can get the fake ones without using that for the male character so to start you're going to head over to any clothing store now just come up to the front desk and go into the Gorka suit outfits and now you're going to want to equip any of the pink Gorka suits so any ones with the joggers that you want you can use this for other colours too but for the sake for the sake of this video I'm going to show you how you can get the pink ones so I like these pink camo ones right here so what we're going to do is just equip it now from here just back out then just open up your interaction menu and then head over to style and then choose change appearance which is going to cost you 100k if you guys don't want to have to spend hours grinding out these glitches, be sure to check out the instant delivery modded accounts from MitchCactus.com, which is available for Xbox, PlayStation and PC. That comes with between 50 million to 1 billion dollars, as well as RP level 100 and more. They also offer account boost, meaning that an existing account of yours can have money or RP added to it. These guys have over 4,500 reviews on their official Trustpilot page and are by far the most highly reputable modders. There will be a link in the pinned comment and description and be sure to use code EVADE for 5% off. Now from here just go over to the apparel and then you're going to want to swap your crew t-shirt to one that you like. But I think this plain black t-shirt looks really nice with these pink joggers so I'm just going to choose that one. Then just save and continue, name the character, and then just load into it back into an online session. Once we go back into an online session, as you can see, we still have these fake pink joggers. So now you can simply just head over to any clothing store and save these. So yeah, that is the first method on how to get the pink joggers. Now these are, as I said, the fake ones. But anyway, let's just get on to the second method. Alright, so for the second method on how to get the pink joggers, I'm going to show you how you can get the real ones for the male character. So to start with this method, you're going to head down to the description and you're going to want to bookmark the drop which will be linked. In the description, there's going to be a link, you're going to click it and you're going to want to bookmark it. Then just come into the game and this is it right here. So go to open your pause menu, go to online, go to jobs, play job, then head over to bookmarks. Then come down to this and then it is right here, it is called pink joggers. So you just want to start it up. Now this job is only for PC, so if you are not on PC, I recommend skip to the next method, as the next method is going to be for all consoles. Yeah, if you are on PC, then just load up the job. Now just simply confirm the settings, invite anyone and start it up. On the screen right here, you just want to hit ready to play. And now as you can see, we're going to spawn in and in a second, we're going to appear with the pink joggers as you can see. So now what we're going to do is just open up the interaction menu, go to style, then you go to accessories and you want to put any pair of gloves on. And then from here you just want to leave the job through your phone. And once you spawn back in, as you can see we still have the pink joggers outfit, plus this one comes with a pink bulletproof helmet as well. And now you can come over to any clothing store and save this and then change whatever you want on the outfit. Yeah, that's the best method on how to get the pink joggers for the male character if you're on PC, without using two consoles. But yeah, anyway, let's get on to the last and final method. Alright, so for the final method on how to get the pink joggers, it is going to be for all consoles and all gens, so whether you're on Xbox, Playstation or PC, or if you're on old gen or new gen, you'll be able to do this. But to start, you're going to come over to any clothing store, and then equip the outfit that you don't want to lose. And then delete all of your saved outfits, as this is going to be a transfer glitch. 
Now, keep in mind that this is only for the female character. But yeah, once you have deleted all your outfits, now just open up your pause menu, go to online, and then choose swap character. Now, from here you should see your main female character on the left, and you should have a new open character on the right. You just want to select the new character on the right. Now, just make sure the gender is set to male, then just save and continue, call the character whatever you want, and load into an online session. From here, just open up your pause menu and make sure you can see the clothing stores. If you can't, you just want to find a new invite only session. Yeah, once you see the clothing stores, just head over to any of them. Now to start, you want to come over to the accessories section and take off all of your accessories. So anything you have on that's an accessory, just take it all off. And now finally, come over to the pants section. Then come into shorts and you're going to equip the red leopard boxer shorts, which is number 41, which are going to be these ones. Now come over to the tops and do the same here. So take off all of your tops, jackets and whatever you're wearing. Now come over to the shoe section and then equip unequip your shoes. So now we should only be wearing these leopard boxer shorts. So now you can come over to the front desk and save this outfit in any slot. I recommend saving it in the first slot. Now once it is all saved, now just open up your interaction menu and take the easier way out. Once we spawn back in, now just open up your pause menu, go to online and start up creator. From here select create a race, then select tutorial and accept this alert. From here just open up your pause menu, go to online and then go to choose character. Now we're going to need to delete the male character that we were just making the outfit on on the right. So just hover over him and delete him. Make sure it's going to tell you to type delete so just do so. And now from here you just want to click B or circle to go back to story mode. Now if you're on next gen, I'm gonna leave a link in the description on how you can get a workaround for this as you don't actually have this option. So yeah, make sure you check that out. But yeah, now once we're in story mode, now just open up your pause menu, go to online and start up an invite only session. Once you spawn in, now just come over to any clothing store or your apartment, it doesn't really matter. Then just come up to the front desk and save the outfit that you wanted to keep. And also there you're going to see the pink joggers outfit that we were making. If we equip that, as you can see yeah, it has the pink joggers. So now you can go change the shoes, the top and make a really cool outfit with this. And these are the real joggers as well as it has the invisible ankles. But yeah that right there, they were three of the best methods on how to get the pink joggers in GTFM online on all consoles. After the patch of 1.66 so I hope you guys did enjoy. Do be sure to drop a like and subscribe. Anyway, I'll see you in the next one.